Tuesday. It's Tuesday because <laughs> they went to Costco. Wait, what? You said every Friday. Yeah, every Friday, but um, they went to Costco today, so I got pizza. Oh, okay. I see. I see. Yeah, I, I already started the stream, by the way. Um, I I wanted to, I should have done this before I started the stream. I need to change my uh my follower goal to August because it's all, it's already almost it's like three hours until August. Oh uh, yeah. So sad. I don't know how to spell August. A U G U S T. Yeah, if it, it, it spell check got me. Don't worry. <laughs> It's August and zero nine, right? Uh, no, it's zero eight. Are you sure? No, that's yeah. It's the no, month, that's it's eighth month. August and ninth month. No, 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 you're right. Wait a minute, I think you're right. Yeah, because I'm looking at my clock, or not my clock, but my um, little calendar thing on the bottom right of my screen. It says it's seven thirty one. So that means August is. Yeah, no, you're right. Oh, I messed up the. Oh my god. Disaster. You know, for some reason, I'm on. Um... Wait, you said you already started, right? Uh, the stream's on, but I'm... <clears throat> I haven't started playing it. Yeah, because, like, it's weird. Whenever. um, It takes, like, a two minutes for it to pop up, actually. Really? That's weird. Yeah. Some people. It's a lot, sometimes people hop on instantly, too, so. Did you try refreshing the page? Yeah, I've been doing that. Oh, okay. Interesting. Yeah, that's really weird. I don't know what that's all about. <laughs> You're just naming it in parts. I guess. I mean, I don't know what else to do. What, what do you recommend something else? Uh. Oh. All right. Uh, well, that's what I was thinking. Oh. Name it. Name it by the. Uh, the the area you're in. I, I don't guess. know. I don't know the area I'm in. What area am I in? Um, you're in not Blight Town. You're in um. Uh, <laughs> when you spawn, it'll tell you. I I don't know exactly off the top of my head. Man, then how am I supposed to name it that? <clears throat> I mean, I guess I could change it after I spawn, but how is this supposed to? Whatever. Um. <laughs> dude, how do you know how much longer the area is that? Um. um there's so if, if you mean, could make it much longer, because if you want to explore everything, explore everything. But, there's there's a whole sewer section. It's not that long, but you get um, an NPC at the end of it, and there's also uh once the, you once once you know like the 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 great um rotwood tree that you're fighting. Yes. Is it wait? Um, is it called the undead settlement? Yeah, undead settlement. Okay. And so have you have you went to? I think it's called something bridge. It's called like dilapidated bridge or something. I forget. It's like this area where um, there's a guy that throws like a bunch of spears at you. Um, you can't see the guy, right? Yeah, you can't see. He just like throws them. And they're they're like mortars essentially. Yeah, I think I've been. Yeah. There. Yeah. That's, okay. You've been that's there. the way I that's... came. Okay. Well, that's that's the area. Um, pretty sure that's it. Cause like <clears throat> there's the there's the. The passage you went where like remember the first time I told you to get into the cage of that one guy um, that was one way and then another way is like if you go to the left from I think the second bonfire you go into like the town and this like old lady starts spamming bees at you bees or, like uh, not bees but you know that like dark circle the fat lady um, yeah I know the at fat you? lady yeah yeah I just call it bees because it just looks like oh bees. I kind of see what you like, mean yeah they kind of they kind of would look like uh I don't know what be like black. They're black, like yeah. these are have black on them. I don't know. All right, but uh, can can you actually load the stream now? Or is huh? It oh yeah. Okay, I I'm just, I was just curious. But you can go there through the town. Um, if you haven't actually well, been. To no, town. I've been. I came that way. I okay. think. Um, and so there should be like somewhere near the um the boss area that you just fought there should be like a door or like somewhere there should be like a great chasm and um 
there should be like stuff uh, be um below there. I think actually I'm looking at your stream. I think like you're by the chasm actually. It's like that uh, big dip. I think I there's like there's the cat. I don't know. I have no idea. Yeah, I mean I can just start going where I haven't been already. Yeah, cause like if you if you um go. Oh, actually to where I can't like go that way. Can I? Well, wait a minute. No, I can't. Never mind. Cause um you'll from that bonfire you'll see the stairs to the great rotwood tree that you fought, mm -hmm. and then you just have to go, go to the, the right way. of it. Yeah, the other yeah. way. And then um, you'll see a big chasm, and an enemy, I think, is supposed to knock you into it, and if you have enough health, you can survive the fall. That sounds like a bad idea. <laughs> I mean, just kind of jump into it <clears throat> and see if you can survive. I mean, like, I... there's there's doors to where you can, you can safely go down there. Oh, I think I found find. the sewer. Yeah. And in the sewer, there's a bunch of rats, which are like the funniest enemy, just because they're just rats. Oh, they're, they're, they're fast, though. Yeah, they are fast, but they're really weak. Yeah, but they're fast. Because <laughs> <laughs> they attack in packs. Alright. Cool. Little rat boys. I don't know if, if it's in this <clears throat> sewer, but like, there's a, there's big rats. Hmm. I mean, those rats are bigger than a normal rat, but... I mean, but, like, um, they're... I assume you mean even bigger. Oh, yep, that's it. They're, like, they're, like, 20 times the size. They're, like, big, fat rats. Yeah, I found it. Okay. It's pretty weak, though, still. So. Yeah, rats are pretty weak, but they, the thing is that they attack in packs, and also they have, like, they attack pretty fast. But by defeating certain enemies, you get Rats like rings. Are definitely a dexterity build, yeah, yeah. And you, yeah. <laughs> and, um, like, and, and, and saving certain NBCs give you certain things also. And you should. I got like, a ring already from the I rat. Did. What does it do? Um, I don't know. It's probably the, if I remember correctly, the ring that I thought I got a ring. helps you uh, not bleed. Yeah, blood bite ring, increased bleed resistance. That doesn't yeah. sound too good. I mean, because some enemies make you bleed. And bleed is really bad. Because, like, bleed, like, bleed, once you oh, get Oh, that was bled, it? That was the whole sewer? Or is there more? Um, I think there's more. But there's, like, another section of the sewer. If you, like, if you have, like, keys to open up the little things. Oh. Uh. Well, I don't. <clears throat> but yeah, I think there is another side of the sewer, actually. It's like, um... Um... Because th there definitely is, like, a place you can go, or, like, a door you can open to where you can get to this one lady who teaches you, like, m healing magic. Um... And she's guarded by this one guy. And, like, you can see if you... If you actually go um, out of the sewer and you go, there's like, there's supposed to be this bridge and there's supposed to be two guys with like big red jugs on their backs. Yeah, their well actually one of them has the chainsaw thing and the other guy has a jug. Okay. Um, Not a chainsaw, but a saw. Oh. Um, and they're, they're gonna oh be wait, he threw a jug and then now he has a saw. Oh. Yeah. Um, so and past that, there is supposed to be a guy sitting on like a stoop. And like or like some stairs, um, by the like the big the big like mansion you're supposed to go in, and you you talk to him and he's like guarding this one. Lady. Oh my god, I'm cornered. Fortnite. Fortnite doesn't work, and you know it, power load. Jeez. Oh, here's the guy. Mm. 
Another one of those unkindled, are you? All you faceless undead, behaving as if you deserve respect. Hmm, no matter. Heed my words. If you've any sense, you go find a coffin to huddle up inside. You, here, in this land of hollows. You're like a frail maiden on the front lines. If, like the others, you're fool enough to play the champion, then go on ahead. Trapes right past the abandoned church. You'll face death. And it won't be pretty. Enough death to leave you broken. Time after time. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Play the Fortnite Killer Minecraft Hunger Games? How's it the Fortnite Killer? <laughs> it is. Okay, I'm back. So, did you go talk to the guy? Yeah, I talked to this, uh, the guy, yeah. So, um, I think I'm pretty sure who you're talking about, the anyway. door only opens from the other side, and so nope. you have to fall you into the open it right now. No, not the big door, the, the, the door to the, the other part of the sewers. Oh, yeah, that only opens from the other side. <clears throat> and I think you just have to fall down. And I'm pretty sure it'll live. Because I did it and I lived. You live with like very low HP, but you live. Also, um, when you actually... I don't know where you're going, but when you actually go inside... Wait a inside, minute, is this an NPC? Wait, oh, I... Oh, you, oh, you met... Um, the, uh, don't attack him. I, well, I hit him twice, but well, he, he's really, he's really bad. Don't, oh. you, like, if you, you could kill him now and like save yourself some trouble later, because he's actually like a bad person. He's like a big dick. Okay. Um, but I don't know if he's that strong. Uh, well, I just hit him and he's not attacking me, and I didn't even mean to. He's just like I assumed it was an enemy. But, um... Uh, no, the... I died from the... Wait a minute. No, I did live with, like, no help. Yeah, and so that's one of the secrets of Dark Souls. And, like, um, there's... Uh, before you go in any doors, there's, like, other areas that, like, you can get items at the yeah. basin. I would like to try to open that door so I don't have to fall down again and take all this damage. But yeah. I have no help. So, okay. So you're probably low health, and I'm gonna teach you a thing that's called embering yourself and so if you go into your equipment wait you i've been told these, embers like, lets other people come to the game no and that's not that's that's red like skull things but oh. embers are if you go into your equipment press the estus flask like slot thing um and then equip embers and they're like these little i think they should be like on the top row of your inventory they're like these little black things they're like kind of like cones. Yeah. And you equip them to your um, Estus flask like place. Yeah, They're I can't even use it though. No, you do. And so what you do is that you you just um, press the use on it, and then you should. Oh no, you already embered. Never mind. I already embered. Cause... Yeah, because like embers um, increase your maximum health, and they full heal you also. But once you're embered, you can't be unembered until you die. And so whenever you beat a boss. You, oh, excuse me. You, you automatically become embered. Oh, I see. And you can tell by the top left, um, mm -hmm. it's like it's all cracked with fire. Yeah, I see it. Yeah. So am I gonna be? Able, I feel like I'm probably just gonna die then. Oh, there's a skelly monster. He just developed. Oh, you met the spooky oh, scary Oh, and now a different skeleton just appeared for me. I mean, kill What the heck? Well, there goes my ember. Now you can ember whenever you have like no help, and also embering is good during boss fights where you know you're gonna take a lot of damage. So you just ember before, get that max HP, uh -huh. and, or just use it whenever you're low health. Yeah, I feel like it would be better to use it when you're low health, wouldn't it? I mean, you can use it whenever. So going back to the area, the fastest way. It to just pretend like you're walking to the boss, but then just like fall down the place you fell down before. 
Because if you try to go in, oh, I just you're trying to go through the sewers. That's like pretty. It, it's okay, but like you'll risk taking more damage that way. Yeah. So just fall down where you uh, were. Wait, what? Where was I? I couldn't... Was it down here? Oh yeah, it was. Come on then. I died this time. Are you serious? Well, there goes all my souls. Probably what? because um you didn't have full health. No, I have. I didn't have full health the first time I jumped in. Oh, I didn't have full health plus oh, ember. Oh, you were though. ember, yeah. Wait, you said there's a different route though. Yeah, just um, go to the bonfire. How you used to. Oh, go to that bonfire. To okay. Yeah. So I should go. I start the other sewer to get there though. No, because it's the same area. It's just linked. The sewers is just like a, a short. It's kind of. It just cuts straight through. Yeah, but the other way is where the arrow guy shoots the arrows, and then I'd have to like. Where's quicker? What the heck? Are you serious? Oh you my god, dude. Yes, I fell. I fell in a uh, serious way ever. They're good in packs. Well, I was all they knocked me off the ladder, that was the problem. That's why you don't go through there, you just go to the other bonfire. Oh my gosh, fine. I but I feel like the other way is worse. I tried no, to go to the other bonfire. No, just teleport to the other oh, bonfire from oh, this bonfire. What? I didn't remember you could do that. Yeah. And then um I forgot I could do that. Yeah, and just walk down the steps and then just turn around and then in the sewer. I mean, not in the sewer, but fall down the little place. <clears throat> okay, here we are. At least you um, found this place is faster. I actually didn't know that this place was faster. So every single time I tried to go to the boss, I went had to like um, dodge through arrows. like all the the spam that he was throwing at me. From yeah, the well I couldn't actually find this bonfire. They had the the stream had to tell me about it. And I was like, oh okay. But yeah, I don't even know. Yeah, I mean the that bonfire is pretty hidden. This thing. Yeah. Which takes some time. Somewhat. Well, hopefully I live this drop. Because as long as I live the drop, yeah, I can just S this class now. Nice. Yeah, because I was, um... I got hit, like, from the big, the big gap, where, like, the guy, like, sniped me with his, um, with his pot that he threw at me. And then I was, I was, a, I thought I died, but apparently I lived with, like, 2 HP, and I was like, dang. Good uh -huh. thing I, like, put all my points into HP. Yeah. HP is pretty good. But the reason I didn't tell you about Embering sooner is because I didn't want you to constantly go into bosses and just Ember before, because items you use before bosses are, like, gone. They don't respawn when you die. 
And so what I what happened to me so is that to like waste all my embers in one box. Yeah, and so what happened to me is that that's what I did. Is that every single time I was like, okay, this is the time, and then I would ember, but then I'd still die, and so someone there. I just someone ran into there. embers, and that's what umbral ash is used for. Is that oh, um, the shopkeeper please. you can buy embers Remember from, but only a certain amount me. until you give her more umbral ash. The dark surrounds So it's a really good item. I just don't overuse it. Mm -hmm. Little like I did, where like halfway through the they game I just couldn't biting. get any more embers. So, so please. Hold out your hand and touch me. And <clears throat> I see you already met the priest. Touch lady. this lady? Is this the NPC you're talking about? Yeah, the NPC that gives you All healing right. magic. Alright, I'll touch her then. Mmm. Right where it's touch. good. There you go. Oh, yes, there you are. So close indeed. And I am not entirely alone. Because she's Just blind. Yet. Oh. Praise the merciful gods above. And so the guy um, is protecting her. I don't know why. Oh, Cause, like, I think me. he, he think that she's like some bad person. I am I Irina know. of Karim. And she just teleported. And if you talk to the guy outside, I came to this land he, so um, that... he, he, I forget what he tells you. <clears throat> yeah, let's try. You like poking around in cells, do you? <laughs> oh yeah. See, I'm so she says that she, um, she came to try and be a firekeeper. <laughs> He just the the guy just said he like oh yeah you like poking around in cells don't you? That's all he said. Yeah, don't fight him. He's really strong. <laughs> well, why would I fight him? He's, I'm not fighting. I'm not attacking any more NPCs. Okay. Okay. And so, uh, once you once you talk to him, just go up those big stairs and then um, take the elevator. Wait. How about the rest of the sewer place? <laughs> no, or? that's it. Wait. What? How about I was? Isn't how about the other way I was going? Oh, did you did you not ex did you not go to like the the big like open area and collect all those items? Uh, I don't think so. No. And there's also a little lizard that gives you twinkling tight. Yeah. Tiny um, tiny Running after right now. Wait, did it disappear? The lizards disappear? Yeah, they, they, they disappear if you don't get them in a, in a time. Oh, rip. So this is the place where I fell down. Like, I just fell, and because <laughs> he sniped me, and then I, I was surprised I lived, and this is how I find about the sewers. Because besides that, I would never have known you can go down here. Mm hmm. No, here's the place with all the skeletons. Oh, there's a lot of skeletons though. Oh, this is gonna be a problem. Skeletons are pretty good. They do, they they know ninjutsu. Yeah, and there's like twenty of them too. But I think you do good because they're they're weak against slash type weapons. Oh, like mine. Yeah, but not poke because you know they're skeletons. I mean, you could kill them. Request absolution. Request dissolution. Oh yeah, this, so this is the lady. Request absolution. Remember oh, how that guy was oh, like disillusion. spawn camping you? Oh, you have not sent. Oh, okay. <laughs> you can request yeah. to, to to not have people hate you anymore. But since you killed them, you have not sinned. How about disillusion? Uh, I forget what that means. Actually. Your curse can be lifted for two thousand five hundred souls. Will you request a reverse Halloween? Oh, a reverse hollowing? I don't know if that does anything. Yeah, uh, I'll just say no. you could become human and regain your humanity. Because, like, oh, after really? a certain amount of times you die, I'm pretty sure you become hollow. But I don't know what that does. It didn't really affect me. Because you can, like, there's items to restore your humanity. But, like, I don't know exactly what they do. I probably have to look it up. But it didn't really affect me. Oh, I see. Add oof. Oof count? What the heck? <laughs> this is probably your death count. He's tried to add a death count yesterday, but he couldn't do it because he's bad. That's a true. Nah, I'm kidding. Oh, wait, what? He forgot, yeah. The reason yeah. they know ninjutsu is because they do ninja flips at you. They like they like spiral through the air. No, they seem pretty easy. If I should have just fought them, honestly, instead of running yeah. past all of them. It's just a lot harder to fight when you have zero health, you know? 
Yeah, I, and also when um that the one that kills you is like one off screen and just backstabs you. Yeah, it was stupid. <laughs> Add test testing. <laughs> How'd that guy get? Is it slashed by some maybe? Here? I feel like you might you might need a slash instead of an ex exclamation point. And so go up the stairs, um, and there'll be there there is an elevator, and in Dark yes. Souls, elevators are good indications of like um, uh, shortcuts. And this elevator, and also elevators are used for tricking you and getting to new areas. So elevators. Whenever you see an elevator, step on it and then roll back. See which direction Wait, it goes. Wait, we don't even have Nightbot? Are you serious? No. Wait, mm -hmm. Nightbot's not here? What are you talking about? Is it not? Yeah, apparently not. Wait, how is that? Why would Nightbot oh. not be active? Hydration box not even here. No, that hydration box always here. Although that's why I thought about Nightbot, so maybe not. But, um... So I was talking about elevators. Elevators, uh -huh. whenever you see an elevator, always step on it and then roll off of it and see if there's another elevator that spawns. Because Why? because if an elevator goes up or down, or the first elevator goes up and down, you roll if you roll off of it, then another elevator will be underneath it that goes the opposite direction. And that could lead to secret areas. Because like you know how when you entered the room there was an elevator going up already? Oh, and yes. that 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 white knight came from the bottom one um so if you didn't attack him he'll say hmm there's a giant up there that keeps throwing spears i don't know how to get to him this elevator only goes down how do i get up there um but if you're quick-witted you'd be like oh so i just get off the first elevator and then wait for the second one and then it'll bring me up mm. Mm. and you should do that with every oh. elevator because they just have secrets so you just touch me. the whole thing absorbed in thought. and then um roll off I am and then the, the, of um, top elevator will come to be honest, I'm in a bit of a pickle. <clears throat> Have you ever walked near a white birch only to be struck by a great arrow? Well, if I'm not mistaken, they come from this tower. Whoever it is, I'm sure I can talk some sense into them. But I have to find a way up. And that's just the trouble. And I actually didn't know about the secret until I finished the game. Down, you where see, I came back and I was like, I wonder if I can kill that giant. And then, well, um, that doesn't get I me used anywhere. the elevator, but I accidentally rolled off. Mm. And I was like, dang it, I have to wait for it. Mm. And then the secret elevator came and I was like, ooh. Interesting. Wait, is there a bonfire I could, I could reset at before uh, going up there? I add Nightbot? I, I did add Nightbot. Wait, Probably is this elevator going to the go bonfire? Yeah, I'm going to go back to the bonfire. Uh, I think I re-added Nightbot here. I think. I, I logged in with it real quick. So try it again. There we go. <laughs> the command oop has been stick. <laughs> so what's that gonna be used for? I don't know. I don't have problems. <laughs> well good. Yeah, now you can add a death counter, I guess. To the elevator. To the elevator. So, a lot of areas, um, if you don't explore fully, um, they have a lot of secret areas. Like, so basically, areas later on in the game, um, especially this place called the Boreal Valley, will have just like a bunch of secret areas you can go. And you just want to make your priority um, exploring as much as you can, because sometimes like 
um, you'll see an area and you're probably like, okay, I got, like, I finished the area, I beat the boss, okay, and you look at your bonfires and you only have, like, three, and then you'll think that's fine, but, um, you'll come to realize that there's, like, if the map list or the bonfire list isn't filled up, then you haven't fully explored. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. But the game tricks you because some areas are um, have only like a couple bonfires, like the first area and like I think the fourth area. How but others have you? like twenty, because like because it because it comes to because like it makes you think that oh well it's it's fine if like maybe this is just an area that has less bonfires. But I thought you said, uh, like there's a whole list. <laughs> Can you not tell? No, it's it's you there's... can't tell. It, the list oh, the is list invisible doesn't... until you. Get the bonfires. Oh, that's. Stupid. They don't tell you how many there are. Right, so that's what makes it tricky. Should I start attacking the giant? Uh, I don't know yet. I mean, giants are. Pretty... Yeah, I'm sure this guy I mean, sucks. They're pretty. They're pretty okay. They're nah, pretty... this guy probably sucks. He can't fight me unless he has a ton of range. Wait, I can't see his health though. Yeah, it's above his head. Seriously? Oh, yeah. I killed him. Wow. Because I didn't actually have to kill him. Um, what I did is that I literally just wait. I did it at the end of the game, and he already dies. For oh. some reason. And you could just take the ring off of him that it gives you. Yeah, I got a ring. So now you can explore that area without, like, having him spam down on you. Yeah, but now there's a ton of enemies over there, too, that... Oh yeah, he doesn't well, I mean, take out you already me. explored probably. Yeah, I did, I did. Extends yeah, range so. of bows. Yeah, a lot of rings are useless if you're just going for one type of build. That's why I suggested you get the blue ring from freeing that one guy in the first area, because the ring, the blue ring gives you mm. um, defense if you're at low health. So like you just become like bulkier when you're low health, and that protects you. Because like a lot of times like. It protects you from um, boss swings that would otherwise kill you because you just have more defense. Mm -hmm. So you gotta summon the. <laughs> so oh, yeah, what's I am up? Back. That teacher's so you back. They gotta summon the other elevator and then go down, and I'm pretty sure there's yeah, gonna I did be that. a guy. Yeah. <clears throat> but it is a good idea to kill um, whatever his face is named. The giant? Uh, no, not the giant. That the, guy uh, that was like the mm. guy in the white armor. Yeah. Really? It's because, a good idea to kill him. Yeah, because um, later on in the game, if you if you don't kill him, he basically like dicks you over a lot. Uh, how does he do that? Uh, cause like he pretends to be nice, but then with the like, bad advice again, don't kill him. <laughs> no, <laughs> you he he actually gives you a sword that's like good against like um something later on, but um. Whoa! Whoa! This is a Boreal enemy. You can tell because all the Boreal enemies have ice attacks. I don't like this guy. No, Sigurd does. In like the, in the in the place with like the swamp and all the giants, um, he basically lowers you down. And he is like, "Hey, fuck you. Have fun dying to all these giants." Patches steals his armor. I don't know who Patches is. Uh, oh my god. Oh, are you saying the guy that's like, um, oh, okay. I get it. So you're saying that not Sigward, but a guy that pretends to be Sigward kills you. Or tries to. Okay. Okay. That makes sense. Dude, that thing was so strong. What the heck? I guess because like they have, they probably have different voices, but like I guess I couldn't tell because I, at that point you don't see Sigurd for like a really long time. Yeah, that guy is strong, but you just gotta roll like through his attacks. Honestly, he get, he makes you frost in, which is like I mean it's, it doesn't really stack that much. The bat lady fell off the cliff. Good. I know 
he takes off his helmet, but like, I mean, you're already being like, um, uh, thrown down there with the giants. Not thrown, but like, um, I don't know how to say, like lowered down there with the giants. But th but the funny thing was, is I killed all the giants before, even though like the the um the like the murky water makes you like fat roll constantly. And I still killed the giants, and then he just like, what have you done? You killed all the giants, how could you, you monster? And then he just leaves like the bitch he is. And then you don't see him until like, um, you get the dilapidated tower, um, key. And then he fucks you over again. If you don't, I'm assuming if you don't give the armor back to Sigurd. Or if you don't kill the imposter, Sigurd. To get to it? <laughs> yeah, have the goal to get to and kill the Abyss Watchers. Why? Uh, because they're a really, um, hard, not hard boss, but like, really cool <gasps> boss. And that's like kind of the point where the tutorial ends. I mean, the part where the tutorial ends. This is definitely not the tutorial anymore. I mean, but th this is kind of like, like, until you fight that boss, then it's like, okay, the boss has become way more complex. Except you're in the giant, because you're in the giant is just like a cool epic boss fight. It's not really meant to be specifically hard. Yeah, 10 hour tutorial. It's not really the tutorial, but like, it's considered that because most of the enemies and bosses you fight are just kind of like baby easy. I don't know what type of babies you guys have, but my baby's not going to be able to do this from there for him. I can't kill this guy, he's too strong. Uh, so what you could do is make your weapon, or no, your weapon can't have elemental effects on it. Either. Nope. See, that's why broadsword, like this game's kind of dumb in the way that, um, the, the one sword I used through like the majority of my playthrough was the broadsword, like which you get at the beginning of the game. Because you could just upgrade it so much, and then like it, it's basically like the most versatile weapon, and it has pretty good stats. It's okay scaling, um, mm -hmm. unless you get lucky and get a really good sword. Otherwise, but um, like the executioner's sword, which is good for um, strength builds. I think it requires some dexterity. I don't remember. But, um, it's pretty. It's a really good sword. Why wasn't my dagger good when I was thief? <laughs> because, because deck sucks. The heck? <laughs> Why is it even in the game then? You could make it work, but like, it, it requires a different play style. Like all these builds, like like pyromancy or just magic in general, it's slow to. It has cast time. And so, like, against um, bosses that are, like, really fast. Oh, I mean, it has high high damage builds, because, like, it has high, um, um, DPS, but, like, it's not really good for beginners. It sucks for beginners, is what I should say. <laughs> not the way that teacher is telling you to. <laughs> I don't know any of the good like deck strats because I haven't played decks, and I don't know anybody had that has played decks because everybody everybody I know plays strength. The strength is just more fun. It's a noob class, right? Broadsword with refined gem dex build is the standard. I mean, but that's running speed strat. running strat. I mean, yeah, it's like high damage. Gotta get through like, the game fast. I mean, but this is more like casual, like do what you want, go in your own pace, you know. I'm no casual. I'm professional speedrunner goes. Oh God. This guy has pretty like telegraphic attacks. Attack. Yeah, they're strong though. No, yeah, I kinda see anything now. Alright. He's dead. I got a really cool sword. Whoa. I think that's a deck sword. I don't know. Check. Oh uh, yeah, I think it is. E. That's that's one thing is that dex wep dex weapons 
like look you get a lot of dex weapons like a lot of the bosses um sell give swords you dex weapons well i mean if you go that build you will basically do twice the damage you're doing right now yeah, because you just that? attack faster. You need, we need a genuine Dark Souls experience. What the heck? Yeah. Because because Dex is I just want you know, to like damage. I said, it's 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 fast. That means it does like twice the damage. But um, it it's a lot of it's it kind of makes you want to be greedy. Because it's like, oh man, maybe I, I can get I can get more swipes in. But like mm -hmm. with Warrior or Knight, it like kind of make oh you're in a new area. Wait, um, what? This is a new area? Yeah, it's the... So, like, on top of the... When you're on the high wall, you could see um, the the village, and then you could road see the forest, and this sacrifices. is the Road of Sacrifices. Yeah. Okay, cool. <clears throat> and the Road of Sacrifices um, is... is uh, it has, it has, so it has two paths. Oh, it also has giant crabs. Uh, but that's, I think, a little later. And you get to meet two NPCs that are pretty cool. You meet to, you get to meet the first girl in the game. Ooh, how about the lady I killed? Uh, in the first playthrough. Technically the first girl. How about the old lady that sells me stuff? No, it's the first It's the first actual person that isn't blind, nor is she old. Oh yeah, and, and how the blind person. girl that I talked to? Yeah. Badly... T Bad teach, lead him straight to the swamp so he doesn't take the wrong way towards the no. cathedral. <laughs> Wait, does he? Do you want me to go to the cathedral? Uh, I mean, cause so like, so like this is the point where I had a little trouble because like you can, I I for, totally forgot that I was taking a side detour because like you meet you have you fight these like two guys that are guarding these two gates and you can either go through the main gate. Um, also, these enemies just spam them down before they have a chance to transform. Because okay. they take a long time, so they're pretty easy. They transform into like these like four winged beasts. Mm -hmm. And if you just spam them down with your weapon, you'll kill them before them. But, so there's, there's one area where you fight the Crystal Sage, and then you, um... And then you go on this like new path, and then you fight the, um... You fight the Abyss Watchers, or you can go to the main gate, that's the side gate, or you can go to the main gate and then go to the Cathedral, and if you, if you, if you don't fight the Abyss Watchers first, you won't know what to do because from the Cathedral, it's kind of a dead end because um, you need a doll to continue, and to get the doll, I think you need to go to the Abyss Watchers and um, get it from them. No, wait. Yes. And then from the Abyss Watchers boss fight, you go and then you go down to the catacombs, and then you fight the 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 spooky, scary bone got boss, if I remember correctly. Yeah, I'm pretty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do. And after you fight the spooky, scary bone boss, that will give you nightmares. Um, you then go to you then open their open the door from their tomb and then you enter the boreal valley and then once you do that you won't, you, like it, it won't let you into the area unless you have a doll and so that's where you use um i like peaches in a pond made for each other <laughs> what? but but then but then you need a doll from i don't think you get it from um the 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 abyss watch but you, 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 you get it from the um, the the deacons of the deep. I'm not sure. I, I forget where you get the doll from, but you have to go to one of the areas to get the doll. Then you have to go back to the other area and then use the doll to get to the new area. Yeah, doll is dropped on the deep. Because yeah. like what I did is I beat the abyss watchers, and then I went to the um, to the catacombs, and then I beat the, uh, the the spooky scary skeleton boss. And so after that. I didn't know what to do because I, I went to the Boreal Valley and I was just like, where's the doll? And I didn't know what to do until I went back and I was just killing some crabs and I was like, wait, I never went to the main entrance. I was just doing the side quest this whole time. I didn't even know I was doing the side part. I didn't even know I, like there was a main part still and I was like, oh dang. So I just went to the main part 
I was like pretty strong, so I um, I did the main part. I killed the Deacons of the Deep, which is a is a pretty okay boss fight. Um, then that's, that's then that's what happened. Alright. But explore this area. It's it's a pretty it, it's pretty small area, but um, because like there's a bonfire like literally once you leave, but there are some items like around here. I'm right, I'm right. I don't like these, uh... Yeah, it is the fast fly creatures, though. I mean, they're, they're pretty easy if you just, like, spam them down, like, one by one. But if you fight multitude of them, then, like... That's why I use the, um, the Executioner's Blade, because it has a, a wide arc that it sweeps in. Is that the one I just got? Executioner's blade. Mm -hmm. It's a it's a broadsword. Ah, oh, okay. Do I even have you it? have to have a lot of strength to wield it. I don't even have that. I don't think. You, yeah, you do. You don't. So whenever you see an item in an area you don't think you can go, just like jump off, and I'm pretty sure you can just go. If you're low on health, you can ember. Oh, I can ember. Here, I'll ember now, then. Honestly. But it takes some time. Does it? Yeah, Here, like, I like it takes a full works. second or so. You oh, you mean just because, like, okay. Oh, you have okay. to crush it. Yeah, I see what you mean. But don't do it too much. I won't. I probably won't ever remember unless I'm reminded <laughs> to. <laughs> And so, two-handed weapons are for dex people, also. The, the, the game gives you a lot of dex weapons, because, like, the only strength weapon they give you is the broadsword, and then the executioner's blade, and then I think another sword. How about the, this axe I'm using? Oh, the axe? I, I think I had the axe, but I just used the, the broadsword, because... I don't know, I just like the sword better than the axe. And it paid off in the end because even though the axe gives you a buff, like you could use elements on it. But there wasn't a lot of um, a lot of weapon, a lot of strength weapons. I found, I found a lot of dex weapons. I didn't find any strength weapons. Maybe I just wasn't farming the right like enemies. Because like I said, I was farming the um, the knight at the start. The, the, yeah, the, yeah, the red like the red cape knight for the lock of knight. I mean. And I was just kind of farming him, and that's why I got the Executioner's Blade and stuff like that. So a lot of them are found in the end game. Like, like a lot of the, um, the boss strength weapons from what I used is the... Is like the, the one that is... I think there's two. I don't know. I think there, I think no. I don't think there was two. I think there was just two I used or I bought. Which was the end boss one. And then, um, or maybe that was Dex, I forget. And then there was the, there is the one that, um, the profaned, um, greatsword, which, like, blew into fire. Or not blew into fire, but, like, um, was enhanced with fire when you used your stance. Or whenever you, you used your heavier attack. And also that area, you can actually, um, go there, where you're looking at. Yeah, and should I just fall down? Out. Yeah. You, you jump, I'm pretty sure. I swear. Oh my gosh, dude. There goes my ember. You gotta jump. I did jump. Oh my gosh. I don't think it was worth it. Or. Bad teacher or strikes again. Could, or what you could do, you could jump. Or, I'm pretty sure if you go closer to the gate, there's just a path and you can go down there. Okay, that sounded like a better idea. 
<laughs> I just, because I remember, because this is like early in the game, so I'm remembering like what I did, and then I'm like, oh wait, I just found another better way. I mean, but it's fine that you die as long as you collect your souls. It doesn't really matter. Well, I have an ember though. That oh, I... yeah, yeah. Well, that, that's the only thing that matters. Yeah, but it's kind of, it was an important thing. Because, I, of course, I'm not going to die again for the rest of the game, so. <laughs> but, yeah, I'm pretty sure there's a path on the left. I don't know. I don't see any path. I think it was before bonfire. you reached the gate, but you got the bonfire, and you get to meet the, the, the first normal person in this whole game. Yeah, don't attack the people, they're pretty nice. Nice people are the only people I attack. Don't attack these people. Okay, I'm not gonna attack it. Any more NPCs this game, trust me. Yeah, they're pretty nice, but they're not helping me with this thing. What the heck? You can actually rest that bonfires to reset enemies. They'll just disappear. Sometimes I can't. It won't let me rest on a bonfire if I'm fighting them. Yeah, if you're fighting, but like before you fight. Well, yeah. You can run to a bonfire and they might get like a shot in on you, but like they'll. Oh, oh hello. How do you do? Oh, so this is a girl. I am Anri yeah. of Astora. It's a lady. Unkindled like you. She's nice. This is Horace, nice armor. A friend and traveling nice. companion. Are you too in search of the Lords of Cinder? We are well along the road of sacrifices. Is her friend. Below Horace, us is the crucifixion um, woods. This is a weird person. Beyond the flooded talks. woods lies Farron Keep. Home of the undead legion. Further yet is the Cathedral of the Deep. We seek the cathedral. Home yeah, of the, the Grim Knight in Firelink, the one that's like super edgy, that's the one that tried to now. kill you. He gives you but a lot of lore about, like, Lord. after, I think, the next I think time they activate paths, after you fight or, or are going, going to fight certain bosses. Need. I don't know. May but, like, he just, or way. if, like, he just keeps spamming his dialogue, but he talks about, like, um, the bosses and, like, different other things that is pretty cool. Ooh, I got some and blue sentinels. He basically just talks about how he's like, man, I hate my life. Wait, wait are we talking about the other, um... No, the guy in Firelink. Firelink's the hub, right? Yeah, Firelink. Yeah, so the guy that I tried to kill before, right? Yeah, the, ed the edge lord. Okay, so you're in the area of the crabs. And if you look up, you can see the area you were previously in, and the area you're going to be in. Also in this area, the crabs are like the one enemy that are like easiest. The guys with the giant, giant tree logs, they actually do tons of damage. Well, don't worry, because I haven't gotten hit. Easy. They're pretty strong. I would avoid the crabs um, and fight them and like try to bait them and fight them one by one. Okay, well, I, once I find the crabs, I'll get to that. And you, you could, yeah, this, this whole area is just like. Also, um, there is deep water, and then. Or I think there is deep water in this area. And um, there's shallow and deep water. And you want to be in the shallow water, because if you're in deep water, um, you have a fat roll. No matter okay. what. There's also a bonfire in this area if you go to the top left. Oh, I found the crabs. In like the forest. No, these aren't the crabs. They're like beetles. I don't even know what they are. They're like weird things. You you'll know when you see the crabs. Well, I thought I knew when I saw the crabs. No, you'll definitely know when you see the crabs. But 
these guys, um, they either spray you with um, weapon poison. breaking stuff or poison. They're spraying you with poison? Yes. Okay. You don't want to be poisoned. Poison, being poisoned sucks. It's like Pokemon. I can hear them moaning. Is that the crabs? What do, What do you mean? What do you hear? I was just like a. Mm. I think those are the, the the zombies with the. Oh the big yeah, you know that's probably it. But there should be a bonfire around here. Not in the water. It's still in the trees. It's like on the left where you were. <laughs> Um, some crazy guy with a cross. Yeah, don't fight him until you find a bonfire. He does really good damage. Yeah, I don't know where He's the also bonfire. crazy. Wait, so, <laughs> so it's in the fire? Or it's in the water? No, it's not in the water. It's still in the tree area where you were. Oh, oh, I found it. I just missed it. Oh, I can't use it because crazy guys attacking me. See, this is why I don't talk to religious people, okay? No, I'm well, you're not a Christian man. No. <laughs> Dude, I can't sleep at the bonfire. You just gotta run away. I'm gonna die. Okay, no more. Oh my god. How far do I have to run? You just gotta run until you get to the bonfire and then sleep at it. I can't because he's attacking me. You gotta, you gotta circle them, and then you gotta be a certain distance, and then you gotta light the bonfire, and then you gotta just spam A to sit on it. Rolling slower, just run. I got it. Oh, I, no, I only lit it. Oh, yeah, God. that's what I'm saying, you have to spam A. <laughs> just ring around the rosy, this one. Alright, there we go. <laughs> Oh, yeah. I'm just watching you. <laughs> All the dark like Knight weapons are like 2 HP. Also, you're about to die because you're still poisoned. Nah, I'm good. No, I said you were about to die. Nope. So, <laughs> yeah, I'm kidding. Okay, so I want you to go in the water. Why? I and kill as many crabs as oh, you can. Oh, here are the crabs. Yeah. See, I told you you'll know when you see crabs. Well, because they look like crabs, but... Oh, no. You, no, those aren't the real crabs. What the heck? So I, you say I know I'm gonna know it when I see it, but I haven't. You're gonna yet. know. You're gonna know when you see the real crabs. They're in the middle of the for the, the forest water. You know when you see the real crabs. Wow! I found another religious guy. Oh, he actually grabbed me. Got a that. sage ring. I forget what that does. That increases magic or something. I don't know. Well, I found a big crab. Yeah, those are the real crabs. Uh, so I recommend only fighting one of them at a time. Why would I want to fight that thing? Uh, because they give you good XP. That's it? XP? Is there even XP in this game? Yeah, and also, they, uh, souls, and also... Well, yeah, not um, XP. And also, to f and also um, in that area, there's a lot of items. That you oh, what? Okay, some guy with a club is murdering me. Yeah, so that's the, the guardian. One of two guardians that guard the gate.
Yes. I can confirm. Yeah, I don't know if I can fight these guys. They're too strong. Nah, you just are not gonna get hit. I'm just gonna fight this crab. <laughs> crab walks sideways. Mm -hmm. Like crabs do. Oh, and then the other guys are still fighting me. Okay, I need to go back to the fire. Twin Dragon Great Shield. Yeah, most shields you're not going to be able to use because they're too heavy. Well, then I make the weight limit better, right? I mean, yeah. Well, that feels way some. better than mine. Actually, I already have one that's better than mine, too. The ward wooden shield. War god wooden shield. I can carry the dragon one, though. I just need to unequip my bow, and boom. I can use it. Nice. Actually, does it grant you 100% Whoa, physical but I protection? don't parry. I, uh, I have this other thing. So, um, look at the shield stats. I don't know if that shield no, is 100% protection. No, I feel only the default one does. Yeah. So only you shields that have 100% protection, even though- Oh, the other- this- this new shield has, like, a lot of damage, though. Yeah. There's, you can, or you could, you could just build. Like I was telling you um, earlier, you could just build shields or a, a class where you just use shields and you just kind of stun people and kill them. Mm -hmm. That seems to be what the, what that shield I just, the great yeah, dragon shield would be for. It's pretty stupid. <laughs> just be a shield <gasps> character and start like bashing against people. They're like only in this area and one other area. They have pretty like televised attacks also. Now that's a crab out of the way, and you can explore more inside this area, and you can get more items that oh, are like out of scattered attacks. Do I need to go through the swamp? Um, it's not a swamp, but you can, but like there's what, a lot what, of It's items. not a swamp. What do you call it then? Uh, because swamp is isn't swamp water like dirty? Yes. This water really isn't dirty. It's what? Like clear. It's not clear. It's a little clear, but. It's probably still be a swamp. Swamp water is just usually dirty. It reflects dirt, light, man. so I, th I think it's pretty. It's pretty it does, just because it reflects light doesn't mean it's clean. It means it, if you can see through it. I mean, Wait, so do I have to go through this area, or can I just go to kill the the church dude? I mean, you miss out on some items and some rings and stuff. Is that the, the wrong way to go? Um, the left way or the middle? The swamp way. Uh, swamp way, no. The left, the, that's the main way you're supposed to go, but the, do like the little castle on the left side, you're supposed to go there, and that's where you fight the abyss monsters and the crystal sea. Oh my god. Religious guy actually killed me. You hate to see that happen. Who streams Dark Souls 3? Let me let me look. Probably all those <laughs> I 
All those Dark Souls 3 speedrunners. I don't know, there's a lot of first runs and blind runs. Like mine? Yeah. Someone's just playing Black Ops 3. <laughs> oh, even though it says Dark Souls 3? <laughs> yeah. Nice. Cl clearly a man of taste. At least you're not the very bottom. You're like in the middle-ish. How, how many views does the, the highest guy have? Uh, 377. Oh my, I have a second highest. Second highest is 99. <laughs> the yeah. third highest is 77. And then it drops off drastically to 65. See, if I can 43, just get 100 viewers, I'll be the second person. Um, you know? Yeah. Yeah. But are you gonna? Am I gonna what? <laughs> Good? Did I feel good? I mean, the last shield I picked up sucked, so. Because in, in Dark Souls, I don't know about Dark Souls 3, because I don't, I think I used it. Uh, but it gives you, it like regenerates your stamina faster. While using it? Oh yeah, he says if you equip it, it'll give you a passive stamina regen. Oh, cool. But I don't know if it got but it. But it doesn't have full physical absorption. I did. Oh, you did, but yeah. I mean, it's it's still good because like it, even though like it doesn't, but it just gives you more stamina or like faster stamina. No, yeah, it's way faster stamina. I'm gonna use this. Is there a way to unpoison poison myself? Ah, like, uh, what? Is there a way to like get off of being poisoned? Uh, you can use moss clubs, but like they're not really worth it. What? This guy just killed me in two hits. Oh, you just had it on your back while two-handing the grace move. Well, I'll just, I'll use this field though. May as well. Shields are used, a lot of times shields aren't even used for... Shielding? Um, yeah, shielding. They're used for like, you know, um, buffs and stuff. You don't really need like really good items to play the game. You just kind of have to. You, just, you can just play through the game if you did. But I do recommend you going um, to the to the side path instead of the main gate. Well, I don't know which where the side path is. It's just like to the left. I don't know where the left is. It's just like, like you know the swamp? Like it's just left of the swamp. What? Am I on the main path right now? Wait, yeah. How do, I don't even know how to get through this. Like I don't see the main, oh wait, no. Yeah, I don't know where to go from 
this door open? There's a lock, no? I thought there was anything on the side. Okay, kill me again. It's an A tier, that sword. Did I pick up a sword? No, he's talking about the uh, fair and great sword. No. Oh. I think it's a sword. But yeah, just go pick up your souls and turn left from the um, swamp area. Where are my souls? What the heck? Oh, there they are. Why are they here? Makes no sense. I mean, yeah, you can you can kill the Black Knight. No, I really don't want to. Okay. Is that um, the thing that's two hitting me? Uh, it's, it's the Black Knight. It's the Knight of Black Knight. Then, yeah, I don't want to fight that thing. Well, I, wish, I mean, I'd watch it too, because like, this is a good fight, you get good soul, but if you don't want to, you don't have to. Well, I mean, I, it killed me twice already. We'll just go the side route then. Which is that, like, little castle to the left of it. I mean, yeah, he might have a rare chance of dropping the weapon, but like, no, not that way. It's to the left. What? What do you mean not this way? You said this is to the left. I this went is to the, the left. this is the main gate. I thought you said I was already at the main gate. Yeah, you were, but you're on a lower level of it. Okay. Oh no. Wow, it died right before bonfire. Feels bad, man. That's why you don't jump down. Well, I didn't realize that there's such a big drop, you know? <laughs> why would there be a ladder then? There's been ladders where there's not big enough drops to, to warrant a ladder. You gotta be safe. That is the main path, but I want you to do the side path first. Alright, after I get the bonfire. Yeah, after you get the bonfire. Although I don't know where the side path is. It's like before you enter the, the big gate thing. It's the, the left it's the little castle on the left side. About the exile sword. They died. Easy money. Prestige is the same, just continue instead of going inside path. No, because the de the, this is like the, the main like place where you go to fight deacons of the deep. Yeah, what's wrong with that? And plus this area is really shitty. Well, I'm going to have to play through it anyway, right? I know, but you want to be stronger. Because like... You have to come back to the forest later anyway? Yeah, you do. Like, you have to go through this way, and then you have to go, and then you have to, um... Is it? No. Is it? Or am I mixing it up? I don't know. Where's the side path? I don't see it. I don't know. Side path is the castle. Maybe I am mixing it up. What Maybe castle? that is the right path. Like, keep going on the, like, hugging the wall. Okay, so yes, walk wow. doesn't uh, this watchers. Yeah, but the swamp's just a really bad area. I don't know, cause like there's, there's these like beasts that just do like a lot of damage and a lot of magical damage, and they're just kind of really annoying because you have to fat roll the entire time, cause it's just like, and plus the and plus the swamp poisons you. Yeah, it sounds annoying. Sounds quite annoying, actually. 
He said he's trusting me, but I never said I knew exactly like the path. All I knew is that the order of operations so I know that it was on the side path or the main path. I thought it was on the side path. Yeah, you can't walk a mile in the line, but like, it's just, it's just, it's still really annoying. I don't know why in every Dark Souls game they insist having a whole area full of, like, poison. It's just really dumb. Stream ruined, no abyss watches. Well, I'll still get to it. I mean, we're only an hour and 15 minutes into the stream. And I said it earlier today, so I could probably, like, that means longer play time. I might even, I don't know, I... Like, Brennan's mom wants me to wake up at 5 or at 8 so I could fill out applications. So, I guess I might just not go to sleep. What? Oh, well, I was saying, I guess you do want to go through the swamp. Why? Because that's a fish watchers, and I, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Whatever, whatever boss you want to fight first, it doesn't matter. I guess it, you have to go either uh, way, anyways. Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna go to uh to the abyss watch it then. I don't like that side path. You spent five hours on Vort Vort tit? Who's Vort? Is that oh, the first um, boss? Yeah, the first boss. Dude, that's because I didn't know how to play this game. You can um press the the run button to slide down. Yeah, I know. Well, prepare for the worst area of your life. All right. It's like the worst area of the entire game. It's so bad. Yeah, let's Welcome see. Can I level up Very before well. doing okay. this? Nope. Yeah. I don't have enough souls. I, I'm gonna Welcome use some souls. Yeah. Oh no. That swamp is just so painful. Also, you have Estus to increase. Oh, really? Estus shards. How many? Did you yeah, see one. or. Oh, okay. Still cool. Nice. Nah. Whatever you S just matters. Also, um, exploring gives you bone shards. Like there's like they're just scattered through everywhere. And says I have no S shards. shards. Hmm? He said I have no S shards. To no, you already noise. reinforced it. Nah, Wait, what? You already did. You reinforced oh, it. Oh I did, oh I didn't even know this. Yeah, so um You're so the quick. Game, Sorry, yeah, go on. Throughout the game, there's um, bone shards, and what you do is you go to the bonfire, and then there's an option to where it says to burn the bone shards, and that's why you and you and you burn them, and then that makes your Estus um, flasks stronger, which basically means they heal more health per Estus flask. Oh, cool. Welcome. Very well then, taken. And I think there is one. Um, you know, like in the beginning area where the dragon was like killing everybody. Yes. I think there was one there. Because, well, sure. like I said, I don't know where every item is, but I know like the general area. And you can also give Andre some coal. What would that do? Uh, I, I don't remember. I didn't. I didn't really <laughs> use Andre. Remember. I, I didn't really, cause I didn't really use Andre outside of um, um, upgrading my weapon. I didn't even use the gems, just cause I don't really care. I, okay. I was fine without the gems. I just kind of sold them, cause I had so much at the end of the game. I was just like, I'm never gonna use these, so I just sold them all. Oh my god, that thing Welcome gave me a lot of souls. Very well then take no. Um hmm. Plus one ring is twenty percent more souls if you remember. I think server ring is in the dilapidated tower. 
near fire lane. Uh, well, I shouldn't... Wait, so you're saying it's here, like in the spawn area? Yeah, but I think it's in the tower. You know the lock tower? Yeah, so I can't get to it since it's locked. Um, you could buy a key, but that's like 20,000 souls you have to spend on a key. Hey, what are you saying? Uh, do you think I should use the rest of these souls I have in my inventory? Uh, only enough to level up. I don't know how much they give me. They, they all give me different amounts. Oh, the boss souls usually give you like, um, 10,000, like, or like the thousands, oh. ten thousands, you know? Okay, um, so you said I'm not, I'm not gonna need, need to use the Great Wood uh, soul, right? Hmm? Am I gonna have to use the Great Wood soul? Um, I'm pretty sure you already looked at all the weapons and like you couldn't buy any of them because like they're all Dex weapons. So, so all these, both these bosses, this the Boreal Valley. Yeah, they're kind of useless. All right. Because like unless you unless you really want the ring. Yeah, you could sell the souls, but I'm pretty sure they they give you the same amount of souls. Yeah, why would I sell souls I for souls? Buy key or pro it up by jumping from the tree? Wait, what? I just bought the key. I didn't jump from any tree. Yeah, it's faster it than faster. popping it. Whatever. But, like, it's cool to eat them. <laughs> so, just like, sell the rest of them? Oh, and it tells me the price. So, 2000 yeah. Not 10000 That's a big difference, but. <laughs> No, I said they range from that. I said like oh, some souls oh. are ten thousand, other souls are like, like the big, the like the the better the boss, the more souls you get. Ashen one. You could get well, the key. You could get more well, souls, but taken. like if you kind of just kill every. Well, I guess yeah, the key would be or not the key, but the ring would be better for you because for me, I just killed everything. Wait, in the area. I can buy the key from this uh, lady. Well, no, you buy the key from the old lady. That, that's, uh -huh. Yeah, that's what I said. Yeah. What's the key look like? Let's see here. It's just a key. It says dilapidated tower key, and in the description it says the key to the tower Power key. Yeah. I don't have enough souls for this. What the heck? Twenty thousand. I thought you had twenty thousand. No, I have nine thousand. What's the other key? Grave key. Yeah, sell more stuff. You yeah, actually should have bought the grave key because grave key, um, it would have helped you get into some areas. Well, it's keys too late are now. Though, keys right? are, yeah, keys basically just um, just for Velka area. Yeah, yeah, I don't know what else I should sell. That was the area where like the rats were. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keys basically just generally help you get into areas. Like some keys are multiple use keys also. I don't know what I should be selling. I still have a lot of stuff I would need to sell. Just sell all the stuff you don't use. You I don't, don't use any of You only need like one or two. Yeah, just sell everything. You don't really. You only need like one or two weapons. All right. Except the frost blade, because I, I think you can actually use the frost blade now. Which one's the frost blade? The blade you got from the 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 guy that. The like, Erith stray sword. Yeah. Erith. Yeah, you can use it. I can. I've been able to use it, but it's dexterity, right? I mean, but like it's 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 more damage than your than your axe. I'm pretty sure. It is. Then just use that one. Okay. You can you can use it fine unless you can't use weapons that have X's by them. But every weapon that yeah doesn't have an X, you can use. My claim, but claymore is just stronger than this thing. Then equip the claymore. But I haven't been using that the entire game. It's kind of really slow. It feels okay. slow. Well, cause it, yeah, it's slow, but it, it's it does a lot of damage and it has a sweeping attack. But it's slow. I mean, 
you could just use it in you could use it in certain areas where you need a sweeping attack. You don't right. have to. I'll keep you don't always weapons. have to always have the weapon. Play more slower, not worth in the long run. Uh, Frostblade is better than axe, but don't upgrade it. Like, what? Why would I not want to upgrade it? I mean, look at the attribute. Well, not attribute requirements, but attribute bonuses. Uh huh. Wait. Um, attribute bonuses. What is that? Like at the bottom. Oh yeah, it's the. And that's the scaling. Okay. And certain weapons have higher scaling. So certain weapons are just better to upgrade because when you upgrade them, they are. It, it's 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 kind of weird to explain, but like, if you upgrade a if you if you have the same weapon and one weapon has D in scaling, but the other weapon has A in scaling, it's better to upgrade the A weapon because it will just be better with what stats you're using than the D weapon, which will always be worse. Because of that D and scaling. Mm -hmm. So you always want to use the better scaling weapon. Okay, so I don't have enough money for this stupid key. Well, then just don't get it. <laughs> I can sell my armor too, actually. Because, like, because, like, honestly, you get you get fossils that are like enough for the key. Do I so. need this armor? Uh, uh, the, uh, all the my... armor is pretty light, and it's pretty. So the only armor I need is the one I'm wearing, right? Yeah. Unless you find something that's better, but you probably wouldn't. No, this is all looks like light armor. Why is this all in the game then? All this armor? Is it for different builds? Yeah, they give you different resistances and stuff, mm -hmm. and better defense versus like different types of weapon types. As an armor slot is not empty, as long I mean, as it's it not empty, doesn't matter. They give you more defense. It just matters if armor is like heavier than the other. It's all about min maxing. Min maxing? What's that? Which is like minimizing the the negatives and maxing the positives. So minimizing the weight and maximizing the defense. Yeah. All right, so I don't have enough souls for this stupid thing. Well, it's fine. But I've already committed so hard. I sold everything. <laughs> you know, you can sell the rings that you're not going to use. Oh, right. I didn't those. think about this. That still won't get me there, but... Yeah, bows are only good in Dark Souls 2, because you need to use bows in Dark Souls 2. So, 300 more. Let's see here. Also, alluring skulls are okay because, like, they allure certain types of enemies. But yeah, and repair powder is—you never use it because your weapon really just never breaks. Because like, weapons um, reset once you go to a bonfire, and even like if you use a weapon for like so long, it just never breaks. Uh huh. Yeah, and you die too often for that to matter. So, whoa, I I see how it is, Nathan. It's no, cell repair I'm just saying powder? just because like, because like, oh, you're gonna that? go through the, you, even if you go through the whole game not dying, once you go to a bonfire, I'm pretty sure it just resets. So it's kind of just really useless, Ashen unless one. you're really just trying to go for that speed run of no deaths. Then you really need repair powder. Oh, I see. Okay. I have to go to this tower out here. Yeah. Did you buy the key? Yeah. Well, the fastest way is just teleport to Gundir's. But it, why would I do that when I can just walk through this fog? 
Because doesn't the fog take like a long time? Yes, so. but it already changed, so. <laughs> oh my god, this dog came out of nowhere. Yeah. Dog tries to push you off the cliff. Wrong way? What? I thought. Yeah, it's it was not this, this way. way. You're supposed to go inside and then you're supposed to go um, up the the right stair um, staircase and then is like the. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. And then um, when you go there, there's a dead tree, or there's a, a living tree, and you just like talk to him and he gives you an item. Or you don't talk to him, it's like you just take his item. Take it. <laughs> yeah, the big tree outside. This is an expensive key, I better you get something out of this. Yeah. Now you can go on the roof. I can and into the other and into the other tower. And also you have access to the the back area of the, the thing. But yeah, if you want later, if you can go to the, the roof of the, the thing and there's a NPC. Okay. So you have to do some you have to use some calculated jumping. All right, all right. I can do calculated there's jumping. This seems pretty easy. Or falling, because there's items on these like little coffins that are sticking out. But just explore this area and then go to the roof. So how come it's snowing on these mountains even more higher than these mountains? What the heck? I don't know. This game clearly has some plot holes. Firekeeper soul? Is that all I open the tower for? No. Pretty sure. I, I forget who you give it to. I think you give it to the firekeeper. But now go to the roof. I don't know how to get there. You jump from the bridge. Like I said, like the, the, the orange roof. You just jump. I think before there's there's items like here, I don't know. Maybe you have to fall down to get them. Well, uh, I feel like I'm gonna die. No, there's like little things that are sticking out. So you can fall onto. That's why it's tactical falling. There's like little caskets that are sticking out. Yeah, I see out. them. But only go to ones that like look solid. Got a Edis ring. Estus ring. I got an Estus that ring. Does, is that, um, I'm pretty sure it increases. Well, Estus flax increase. HP recovery with Estus flax. But then I have to, I lose my HP ring. Which one's better? Probably the Estus. Uh, or wait, can I wear both? Yeah, you oh, can. Oh, I can. Wear both. Nice. OP. Oh, now I have to look. You can wear four rings. I'm gonna fat roll it now. Oh my god. Oh, wait, I can unequip my bow. There we go. Alright. Wait, I didn't even. I can equip four rings this entire time? Yeah, there's four ring slots. Dude, then why didn't I get that the eyeball ring that rec I recover health when I attack? Rings really that once you once you have rings that you want to actually put on, that ring's just kind of garbage. Mm. Is that the only other place the tower leads me? 
Yeah, pretty much. Wow. I don't think it was worth that much. But you gotta go on the roof. This doesn't make me feel any better. You gotta go on the roof. Oh, I haven't done that yet? I thought I fell down no. the thing. Here, wait, this is Lady. You're an unkindled, aren't you? I am Sirius of the Sunless Realms, former servant of the Divinity. Duties we each bear, but one's duty is a solitary affair. I doubt we've much to gain from fraternization. Blessing of the moon upon your journey. This lady didn't do anything for me. Useless lady. She's a nice lady. Well, you know, I look for more than just niceness, okay? Anyways, go back and then just jump off the bridge. Why does the area have to reload? Are you serious? Can it be loaded in? Can it? It should be able to. I mean, I feel like once it's loaded, it should just stay loaded in, you know? Nah. Wait, where's this tree I can talk to? Uh, the, the tree once you leave. Like, it's the big tree. Once I leave? What? Yeah, once you leave the shrine, it's literally the tree right in front of you when you um, leave the shrine. Okay, I'm on the roof. Is there anything on, up here? Oh, uh, there's bird? items. Whoa, it's a bird. Whoa, what? You. You. Oh, you found the bird? Me. Me. Pickle pea. Me. Me. Thump the rum. We don't really do anything with that yet. Okay. Or I haven't okay. done anything, so. On the thing. On the roof. Oh, sorry, on the roof, the little item. Somewhere. Oh, oh, I found the AI item. I don't know if it's the one you're talking about. Is it a ring? Uh, Estes shard. Oh, oh Estes I got another Estes glass. Oh, I know, I fell. That's fine, though. <laughs> Actually, no, it's not, because you have to go back. Get my souls? That's no big deal, right? No, but you have to go back on the roof, because... Yeah. yeah. Ah, tastes good. What? But I have to go up back up there anyway, right? Yeah, I guess. Pretty be careful. Oh, you mean I could've just stayed up there if I didn't die? <laughs> yeah. I see. I got the ring? What ring? Oh, no, no, I didn't get the ring. Because it's on the higher levels of the roof. So not where I was, even higher? Yeah, like it was like on the orange tile. Okay. Pretty sure. Also, you haven't talked to the tree yet. I'm not. Oh, I think I know where the- wait a minute. What? Where's- is this ladder? Ah, now I can just walk up here. That's better. Yeah, I don't see where this ring is going to be. Ah, this has to be it. Nope, homeward bow, bone. You hide your invisible wall. Oh, I didn't know that. The trees don't talk silly. <laughs> Which invisible wall? What? You just start hitting the walls. Why? Some walls and um, you can go through. 
On the roof? Yeah. What walls up here? I don't understand. Uh, just start hitting all the, the, the bricks that are underneath the archways. The ones that look like entrances. Wait a minute, I don't understand. So is it on the very top of the roof or in that weird roofy spot? I, I want to fall down. Goes, can't you stream uh, to bad teach on Discord so he can watch you live? And Twitch? Um, I guess I could screen share with him, but that I don't know if how much data that would take. You want me to try that? Sure. Okay. Well, I feel like it's still d slightly delayed. How did another guy do that once? Uh, yeah, I'll try. Um, is it there yet? It's still loading for me. Mm, not there yet. You guys need to be in sync. Yeah, that's what I feel like too. Yeah, I mean, it's been fine. I mean, it's not in sync though. I mean, because like, I don't know, because like the coaching, the like the teach, not the teaching, but like the advice <laughs> I'm giving you isn't, isn't really like isn't really like, oh man, you gotta dodge at this moment, you gotta do this. It's most like, oh, you can do this in the world. Or, oh, there's an item here or something. Um, I don't know why this isn't working. Oh, maybe because, here, give me a second. Hey, tell me if you see it on Discord. Real awkward when trying to find items, yeah, that makes sense. Here, do you see it? On Discord? Uh, not yet. No? Ugh. I don't know if it's gonna work. Do I have to swing at the walls or can I just try to run into them? Nathan? Oh, uh, yes. What? What? What happened? Nathan? Oh, I'm here. Can you hear? Or is it working through Discord now? No, it's not. Huh. It's hard. My brother was in my room. It's like. Oh, uh, sorry. Room. My bad. Okay, so that's not gonna work. Maybe if I just try a normal screen share. Here, does that work? That works. Alright. I just do it that way. The, on the roof, on the flat bit, there is an opening in the wall. What, what do you mean, opening in the wall? I suppose, I assume this is the flat bit. There's these openings. I don't think that's what you mean. There's the... Did he say it was an invisible wall? You said an invisible wall. No, he did. Behind the an, an invisible wall. Yeah, I guess so. So I just start hitting walls on the flat part inside. Inside? Ew. Yeah, I'm guessing. Oh, yeah, interesting. There's just an invisible wall, that's stupid. Oh, I got a ring, yeah. Wow, you got the ring. Fallen foes yield more souls. Oh, nice. So that's it now? Yeah. You're stupid. 
How am I stupid? I, th I thought it was on the very roof, not in the inside part. Yeah, it, it is. It is a weird because, like, because like, I guess the in the indicator is supposed to be like how there's this whole um, out, out beside or behind Lorien's um, uh, throne. There's like this whole back area, uh -huh. but it's, it's it's just empty space. But I guess like you're supposed to know that. Oh, what if I just hit the wall and then I can walk above it? Interesting. Alright, I didn't miss anything, right? That was all no. there was to do. So now you get to now do time the, for the best swamp area. area. Yay! Extinguish the flames and open the doors to the wolf flood. Alright, no problem. Don't get toxic. I don't like extinguish flames. Uh, no, don't, no. Extinguish the big flames. Like, look up. Um. There's like, there's like big ones. There's three they? of them. And so you have to you have to search around and find them. I don't see any big flames. Yeah, look like like turn left and then look up. Oh no! I, oh okay, I see. And so just walk towards those. But I think the one on your left is the closer one. Like the one, I don't know if it was the left or the middle. Again, yes, to show. Nice. Yeah, just go up the stairs. And then there'd be some dudes, and you gotta fight some dudes. And they just throw poison at you. It's hilarious, really annoying. It's just poison. Okay, I'm gonna die. And you, you could just run past them. I'm running past them. <laughs> and then go to the little stove. And then interact with it. No, go back. No, there was there a fire in the stove? Yeah, there's a fire yeah, in the I stove. Yeah, I saw it. I saw it. <laughs> no, I didn't. Wait a minute. Oh, that stove. It's not... Okay, whatever. Ooh. I am a filthy beast? Okay, then, facetious. I'm cleaning my apartment, so I don't know. Oh, okay. Yeah, we got the Discord to work. If you spoke with the knight, we would have told you what to do here. I mean, I would have figured it out. I would have just gone straight and then ended up doing that. This is the door that opens with the Baron peeps. Okay. Okay, I don't like the swamp. Here, I'm gonna reset a bonfire. Which also has a low latency option, which makes Twitch chat less delayed. But it, it takes uh it lowers the quality, I think. Yeah, it does. Yeah, so. So there's parts of the swamp, as you can tell, um, that are um deeper. Yeah. So that. Really annoying. So what we're gonna do is there's actually a bonfire in the middle of the swamp, like in this tower. And that's where you join the um, the, the wolf's covenant. And 
those enemies try to break your weapon with the powder, basically. No. Also, they spew death. So, like, if, if that, or they, it's curse, I think, but it's also called death. Okay. Um, if, the, if, they, if they hit you enough and that bar fills, you just insta die. Oh, that kind of doesn't sound good. But I think it's that o it's only that one enemy. In the entire game? Okay. What the heck? This thing just killed me in two hits. I mean, yeah, because you kind of just stood still and let him jump on you. Why is he so strong? Wait, in in the swamp, what would we, what you want to do is just follow the islands. I didn't see any islands. Just like the pieces of the p pieces of land. It's like yeah, go to the next fire, which is that one you're going to. That's why nobody likes these levels, just because like they poison you, and it's just like really. It's it's just really dumb. No way to avoid also it either. Be, oh yeah. Also, be careful. Those big enemies. Uh -huh. They throw magic at you. Yeah, they're also very big. Yeah, and like, and especially, they're only in <gasps> places where you could kill them now because you're on dry Is land. Is he but, strong though? Um, eh. he's just hard because um, when you when you can't fast roll, his attacks just like do so much. You're so slow. Oh my god. Yeah. Okay, well, there it goes all my souls. I guess I didn't have that many. I just sold my, my soul for that key, but. So that's why you kind of want to avoid them. You can go through the whole area without getting poisoned once if you follow the islands piece. So I was like, okay, I mean, I'll try. You could, but like, I mean, to get to this one, it's kind of. And like also you could wear the ring. Which ring? But like I don't it, it's a it's a ring I think you would have gotten earlier or maybe a little later. Uh where it reduces poison damage. Or re poison build up. Yeah, but just run to the kiln or the little like stove thing. Is this the fire in this area? So I don't have to keep going. Yeah. There's one more. But in the, I think in the middle, or like close to one of the edges, there's um, uh, what is it? There's um, there's a tower. Actually, no, the tower is close to the um the entrance to Farron's Keep. So basically, you know that door that you just saw? That's the entrance to Farron's Keep, and you can just roll through those. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I could have just collected my souls. What? Why didn't anybody tell me about that? Oh, because I was kind of twisted where you were. Okay, so, um, should, do I keep going, or do, should I go back? Keep going. Or? You should probably find the tower, because like this last one is like a little weird where it is, because I think it's like the closest one to um the the door. And you're just gonna have to like look for a big piece of land. Worse, I'm gonna die for sure yeah. right now. Teacher told you to go to the right place. This I did. I told them to go to the left, and then I told them to go to the right, and then I forgot where the middle one was. I'm pretty sure it's just in the middle. Just, just hug one of the walls. Sure, you just avoid these guys. Plus, this area is kind of wonky because like everything just looks the same. 
But I think that's the tower they're supposed to go go to that you're looking at now. Oh my god. You can mash your buttons. Now I forget where the middle one is. <laughs> so how could you tell me to go to the right place? What? He was telling you how you, you if only you tell me to go to the right place. And then you're like, I did, but I just didn't know where the middle one was. Yeah, I told you where to go the first two, but yeah, it's just but... the middle one's hard to find because it's 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 either like you what what I did is that I just went to the big tower in the middle. There's a bonfire there, and then there's the great wolf. That yeah, that you went to the wolf covenant. And then... Yeah, but the, the, what he's trying to say is you couldn't tell me where to go if you didn't know where to go yourself. I think. I think I'm doing pretty pretty good because like if at least I'm guiding you because like this area is like just pretty like much a mess like a lot of areas just look the same okay so where do I go from here that's the question you want to get into that tower which on tower your left. okay so I just cut the stick to the wall What are you saying? What's up? Oh, it's just, it smells like something is burning in here. <laughs> oh, well, I'm not. Yeah, I wouldn't be able to tell. Do I go up that ladder? Look, this is the tower. See, I thought the other one was the tower, but that's the fake tower. This is this. I just don't like this area. Everything looks the same because there's so many trees that block your like view. It just everything looks the same. And then there's a bonfire. Good. <laughs> behind I think I think it's behind an invisible wall but just go to the wolf first it's right here oh no never mind okay no. there's some oh no 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 see that item see I was I, I knew what I was talking about so go up the stairs and then there's going to be no no not those but there's going to be a um thing invisible wall and that's how you get the item if you go if you hug the left wall and go up those left stairs and then you hit like an invisible wall at the top of those stairs. After getting this thing, but no, no. You can jump attack to get him. I don't know how to do that. You just jump and attack. So go back. And at the 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 peak of those stairs, there's an invisible wall to your right. It's not letting me attack at when I jump. Alright, cool. And then you get the lift. Dream Chaser's ashes here. Yeah. Oh, good job, Bad Teach. Let's go. I don't know what he wants me to do. I don't. I. I nah, he said good job. He did the right thing. Pray oh, yeah, to Old Wolf. Yeah. Baron, I, should I do that? Pray. Ooh. I just join it. <laughs> so go to your equipment. Should I offer him? No, I don't. I can't. So go to your equipment, and then I'm pretty sure in the in the little like you see go okay. So go down to your rings, and then go all the way right, and then there, and then go yeah, the Watchdogs of Farin. Oh, I had the blue. I had this one though. Yeah, but you Watchdogs of Farin gets better. Okay, what does it do? And then the top left, I think exit out of the menus, and then in the top left you'll see. Yes, a wolf. I see that. What does that do? It just looks cool. <laughs> oh my god, 
Okay. What? And it and like and and when you become and you, when you gain humanity, it becomes all green. And then when you become embered, the wolf like looks like he's like on fire. Mmm. Yeah, it does seem like it would be cool. I agree, it's cool. It's just like if that is that it? <laughs> yeah. I mean, it just shows that you're in the covenant. Nice. Okay, I'm about to fight the boss, right? I don't. I actually never been to this area. I never got like on top of here. That's oh dang, a that's a that's a thingy. Oh my god. It looks like the, the prison guardian or the prison demon. Um, from the first Dark Souls. Really? To me it looks like the Emperor Bullblax trying to use the butt stomp move. Um, See, if he had the blue sapphire ring and he got low health, he would, would it be taking so much damage? Rawr! Oh, I didn't mean to do that twice. Oh, that butt stomp does a lot of damage. God. You should roll later. What the heck? Also, never panic when you're trying to roll. That's like the worst thing you, do. you always gotta time it. I never panic. I just don't know how long it's gonna take for these really slow attacks to come out, you know? Just whenever you see it coming at you, right, roll. I died. That's, like, that's a good thing. This is the only enemy in Dark Souls 3 where you can hit off limbs? Yeah, because in Dark Souls 1 and 2 you can hit off like enemy limbs and that makes them... That takes a chunk of their health down and also makes them like just easier. Weaker? Yeah. Yeah. And some boss is easier because like there's this boss, I think it's called like Lost Isolith or, or something where um... It... It um no no Lost Isolith is an area never mind but it's this boss with like this giant it's a giant dragon with this like um it doesn't have any wings and it's like long tail and it uses its tail as a sweeping attack but you can chop off its tail and um it can't do the sweeping attack anymore. Okay, makes sense. That of chaos is that what you're talking about? But yeah, probably. I don't know. It like it like stands up and has like a bunch of teeth on its chest. See, and then sometimes the enemy like it, the game unlocks onto an enemy. Like you lose your lock for some reason. That's why locking onto the game sucks. Never lost my lock. It just happened to me. Oh, he grabbed me. Yeah, you have auto lock on, auto lock on. No, I don't have it on. Oh, he kind of threw you off. Dude, he almost killed me, yeah. It's a bad one thing. Oh, and I ended up dying anyway. I seriously, it smells like something's burning. You better go check. I mean, I'm clearly fighting this boss now, so I'm not going to be needing you for a little bit. Uh, but, I mean, yeah, just make sure your house isn't burning down. I don't know. Yeah, I don't think it is. It just smells. That wouldn't make any sense for anything to... Check your GPU. It's not. He's not running a game. He's not gonna. It's not gonna be his GPU. <laughs> I don't think the GPU. I don't think it would smell if it if it's burning. It would just start melting slowly. Unless it was like really hot, I guess. Thank you. 
Who knows? <laughs> All right, Nathan, check your GPU, okay? We don't want your GPU to go bad. And not even running anything. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I mean, Twitch uses a stupid amount of resources, I know, right? No, see, when he jumped, I, I lost my lock on. That's because he just becomes too high. Oh my god, did I die from that? Oh my god. If you remove this, you remove your... Varanity sticker? Wait, what? Wait, what? If you remove this, you remove your Varanity sticker. What's that? Mm -hmm. Oh, the warning labels can smell? Oh, on the GPU? Interesting. Oh, warranty. No, this is warning. Oh, no, no, you translated it. Never mind. <laughs> Are you in an air conditioned room right now? Yeah. I really feel like it, it's not your GG then. <laughs> I don't know, I think it's just like somewhere else. This boss is pretty cool. So this is this a boss? I thought I was just sucking against the normal enemy. No, it probably is a boss. I don't know, uh. I don't know, it doesn't have like. The, the little thing on the bottom of the screen. If there was a boss, it would show like its health at the bottom. I guess you're right. I don't think it's a boss. It's like... He grabbed me. If I die, he's just gonna, he's check gonna me toss you off. <laughs> <laughs> That's a yeet if I've ever seen one. His house is just burning down or something. <laughs> That was stupid. I don't like this boss. I was like, I was like, no, he's gonna throw you off, and he just yeeted you across the screen. <laughs> uh, that was great. It's so stupid. This is the. Yeah, this is completely. I didn't even know this, this is existed. an optional zone. Are you serious? Why am I yeah. even doing this? You, because. You wanted to. I told. I even told you that I have never been here. You don't have to go here. I th you said to climb the tower, I thought we were turning off the fire. No, I said climb the tower to have a better view, not climb the tower to climb the tower more to fight a boss. Oh my god. You don't have to fight this thing. It probably gives you a good item, but like... Fine, I'll just I'll fight it anyway. I'm gonna see what's over here though. Okay. I, I doubt this opens. I feel like it's just this boss. Oh, the turtle man's on the other side. Oh, this is probably the bridge. Um, you know, like the bridge, like high wall, high wall of Lothric, like how you met the turtle guy and like, um, there was. Yeah, a oh yeah. Bridge. Well, no, but so no, this isn't the bridge because there, or maybe this, this is the other side of the bridge. Maybe. Yeah, I don't know. The lore, see? No. Well, okay, I don't think I can avoid that attack. You can. Just, just run. Don't dodge. Just run. Oh, that's a good idea. I'm dealing with that. God, it really smells. If it's that bad, you probably need to check something. Oh. Maybe it's your GPU. No. <laughs> Hot, but like that's normal. Yeah, that's normal. It doesn't smell like smoke. Probably my brother burning candles or something, because that's what the candles smell like. Bad teach is the smell coming from outside. Might be some else's someone else's GPU. Or it could be like <laughs> a fire. There's a lot of fire. Here, hold on. I mean, for a human to smell something, it has to be pretty strong, so.
back. Also, he no. died again. Dude, I kills me in two hits. I don't know what to do. It's not. It's nothing. It's it's literally just um my brother's candles. So they were candles. Yeah. That's why I don't like candles for the most part. Candles were for back in the day when you couldn't use a light, like a light bulb, you know? That's what candles were meant for. We're not meant to just light and have weird smells and stuff. It's a repo it's a repurposed tool. I'm gonna clip that actually. What? Me dying? When you got yeeted off the oh. thing. <laughs> where, where, how far can you clip this? Uh, you have to go back when, uh, once the stream's over. God. I think. I want to see if it goes a different way. We're screwed. We need a, we need a, we need a clip you getting like yeeted off the stage. Did you say where's Fury? I don't know. Make it into a Twitch animation? What do you mean by Twitch animation? Fury's not even here. Is he? I don't know. I don't know. That long. I, I mean, I'm sure he, he would be talking if he was here. Let's, let's talk trash about Fury until he, he comes. 